Now for a look at what one community college did to salvage this semester for students affected by the tornado. The storm destroyed a building that was home to telecommunications students at Lincoln Trail College. But the college worked with several partners to figure out a plan and avoid canceling classes for the rest of the year. Will Price joining us now from Robinson with those details. Will. The program focuses on developing workers to help communication companies install things like internet into businesses and homes. Now the building and equipment at Lincoln Trail College were ravaged by the tornado. You can see behind me where it used to stand before it was torn down due to the damage. However, the lead instructor took the necessary steps to ensure that students can continue to complete their courses this year and beyond. I was really sad. I was like, wow, like all Everything we've been working on, oh, it's gone. Those are the words of Isaiah Henriquez, one of the current students in Lincoln Trail College's telecommunications program. The Harry L. Crisp Educational Center was destroyed by the storm, leaving equipment scattered across the area. Our friend, a classmate of mine, lives across the street, and he told us that he could see the fiber reels in it just around his house and our splices around his house. And I was just like, Wow, what are we going to do? Here's some of what these students typically do. Learning how to install equipment, climb poles, and work lifts. Following the storm, lead instructor Travis Matthews says he immediately got to work to figure out what will be next. So the first steps when we came in Monday was start contacting our advisory council and our industry partners to ask them if there were any type of equipment that they could get to us and help us to kind of finish out the semester. The equipment is currently on its way and will be installed in buildings on the northern campus later this week. Matthew says as a result, they pushed to have students like Enriquez start summer internships early, and he will begin next week. I kind of accepted what, what's going to happen. I think it gets us and putting us in the workforce, you know. He doesn't get to teach us, but I'm sure during the internship we'll, you know, be taught what we need to know. Matthew says lectures are moved online flexibility they grew accustomed to during the pandemic and this wouldn't be possible without the help they've received around the area our industry partners I want to thank them a lot and just the support that we've had around here Matthew says they will continue to use buildings in the north campus until they can finish development on a new tech center and that was started before the storm came uh, and that will be done sometime in early 2025 Dana all right, definitely we can see work behind you there will taking place. Thanks so much.